think we made it just in time to catch the sunset. I know I'm not alone in this, but it's always frustrated me when people don't value the things that I value. And I don't mean like religion or morality or anything like that, but I mean like the things we take for granted. For instance, I can come up to this rooftop any day or night of the week and chances are I have the whole thing and this view to myself. There are 500 units in this building and I'm up here alone tonight. really short this week. I got to spend the weekend with a few of my favorite creators and just people, period. I had three really great conversations with three different amazing artists. There was a common theme that ran throughout all of those, and that was that I wish more people understood that as an artist, as a creator of any kind, 99% of the work that you do happens completely alone. You see, for us, it's really easy. Everything is so accessible so quickly. A podcast, a song, a video. We've got all of these great apps and all these amazing platforms that help us as creators upload that stuff and make it accessible to you guys. And you can consume it in a heartbeat. But the problem is most of us don't even finish digesting what it is that we listen to or watch before we move on. I wish that more people understood that even though we can listen to a song in five minutes or watch a video in a few minutes or just look at a painting without a moment thinking that hours and hours and hours of someone's thought and struggle and ability went into making that. You know, even things like the monthly events that we put on as a team, I mean, it takes hours just to pull those together and organize the thing, book them, find the venue and the partners, and then the night of comes, and we've got a bunch of really talented creators that come and dedicate their time to film the entire event, which might take four hours. We've got an awesome uh, audio team that sits down and records the whole thing, and then and when the night's over and everything's been packed up, those people are gonna go home by themselves alone in the dark and sit down and edit and make sure that everything looks incredible so that we can boil it down to a two to five minute performance or recap video that you guys can consume and to be honest, might not even finish. So this week, there really is no vlog. Instead, I wanna highlight two of my favorite creators that I think are hugely undervalued. The first one is Brian Espinosa. He's our creative director of visual arts and he handles all of our event recaps and artist performances. He just put together a great little recap for one of our events back in March. And on top of that, he has his own channel with his own vlogs and they're phenomenal. You guys have to see them. The second one is Nick Flora. He's a really good friend of mine and just a prolific guy. He's put out a bunch of records. They're all great. And he has a brand new EP out called Conversation Arts. Listen to it and thank me later. He also has a podcast called All Time Favorite and he's one of the funniest guys you will ever listen to, I promise. So check out their links in the description below or in the post. And most importantly, if you like what you see and you like what you hear, let them know because that means more to us than you guys have any idea. Bye -bye.